This video is an example of converting odds to a probability. If the odds on a bet are 37 to 1 against, what is the probability of winning? Express your answer as a fraction. So we have um, 37 to 1 against. So we could convert this to a probability by using the expected value equation, but I'm just going to set this up as a proportion problem. If we have 37 to 1 against, I can write this as a fraction, 37 to 1, like so. And because this is against, I'm going to put 1 minus p, where p is the probability of 4, your um, event occurring, and in the denominator, I'll have p. Okay, so against goes with 1 minus p goes with 37. You want to make sure they're in the same position um, on either side of the equation. And then the 4, the 1 goes with the p, like so. Okay, again, when you um, solve this, you'll end up getting the expected value equation form out of this, but in my head, I think this is easier to see. Plus, you don't have to have the expected value formula memorized. Okay, so you might remember that when you have a fraction set equal to a fraction like this, you can just cross multiply. So this is going to be 37p is equal to 1 minus p, because 1 times 1 minus p is just 1 minus p. All right, so moving um, things over to the other side, namely the p. I want to add p on the right side, so I'll get 38p on the left. Okay, adding p to both sides of the equation is equal to 1. Last step to solve this, a simple um, last step here. I want to divide both sides by 38. So the probability um, of winning in this problem is 1 out of 38. The probability of losing will be the complement, or 1 minus p, because we just have two outcomes, winning or losing, and those are complementary events, and complementary events sum to 1. So 1 minus 1 over 38 is going to be um, 37 over 38, and you'll see that indeed p and 1 minus p add to 1.